Okay, so this is our problem number 5 for centroids of area. So the shaded area is given in the figure 48.0. Find the centroids of the area from x and y axis. So ito yung ating uh, shaded area. So isang rectangular, isang rectangle and isang, uh, isang, isang triangle and isang rectangle. Okay? So ngayon, uh, mayroon dalawang area. So mayroon dalawang area 1 na lang natin is yung ating triangle and area 2 natin is yung ating rectangle. Siyempre, mayroon silang kanya-kanya mga ano, uh, centroids. Tama ba? So, dito sa ating uh, rectangle, uh, sa mga ating uh, okay. sa rectangle, ang kanyang centroids is nasa inaadit na. Okay? So, kita ka natin. Yung kanyang uh, y bar 2. Okay? Ito naman yung kanyang y bar. Ay, sorry, sorry. This is x bar 2. Okay? So, ito naman yung ating uh, location, yung centroids ng ating triangle. Namula dito sa kabila, one third. So, mula dito sa top, sa uh, previous problem natin, that is, uh, so, natin x bar 1. Uh, okay? Tapos, yung taas niya, ito. That is, so, natin y bar 1. Uh, okay? So, dito, uh, ang ating uh, area, 1 is equals to 1 half of base na 400 multiplied by the height na 300. So, ang ating uh, area, 1 is equals to 60,000 mm squared. At yung ating uh, y bar 1 is equals to 1 third of its height. So, one third of its height na 300 so this is equals to 100 millimeter okay at yung ating uh, x bar 1 kung magsima tayo sa base that is one third of its uh, base so dito nyan magiging two thirds of its base at ang base natin is 400 so this is equal to 266.667 millimeter okay Tapos yung ating uh, area 2. Ang ating area 2 is a rectangle. Ang base niya is 200. Ang height niya is 300 plus 100. Ito. Okay? So, ang ating uh, area 2 is equal to 80,000 mm squared. Ang ating namang uh, y bar 2 is kalahati ng ating height. At ang ating height is 400. So, this is 400 over 2. So, this is equal to 200 mm. At ang ating x bar 2 is equal to 400 to plus yung location natin centroids which is kalahati ng 200. So, 200 over 2. So, this is equal to 500 mm. Okay? So, ngayon, uh, solving for x bar so <clears throat> area total multiplied by x bar is equals to summation of all area multiplied by their x bar okay so x bar is equals to area 1 which is equals to 60,000 multiplied by x bar 1 na 266.667 plus area 2 na 80,000 multiplied by x bar 2 na sorry, this is 500 over total area which is equals to 60,000 plus 80,000 so ang ating x bar is equal to 400.0 mm okay yan so, location doon ng ating x bar is nandita. Ayan. Yung overall x bar natin. So, ito yung ating x bar. So, ngayon, solving for y bar naman. So, solving for y bar, area total multiplied by y bar Sequence to summation of all area multiplied by their centroids in terms of y. 
Okay? So, y bar is equals to area 1 na 60,000 multiplied by y bar 1 na 100 plus area 2 na 80,000 multiplied by y bar 2 na 200 over area total na 60,000 plus 80,000. So, ang ating y bar is equal to 157.5. 143 millimeter. Okay? So, yung ating overall Y bar from its base is nakalocate. Nakalocate ng 157.143. So, this is our problem number 5 for centroids of area. So, thank you for watching. Bye-bye.